Hi, and welcome to the NICU at UNC Health. Today we're going to talk about kangaroo care, which is a well-researched way to support your baby's development. Kangaroo care is holding your baby to your bare chest while your baby is wearing only a diaper. This type of holding is particularly beneficial for preterm infants as they can hear their parents' heartbeat, smell and feel their skin, and hear their parents' gentle voice as they did in the womb. Kangaroo care can give your baby positive experiences that support the development of their brain. Many preterm infants held in this way need less support for breathing, spend less overall time in the hospital, and do better with breast or bottle feeding. As a parent, you may feel more connected with your baby during and after holding them. If you are pumping or breastfeeding, holding your baby skin to skin may help you produce more milk. In this video, we will provide you with tips that will help you and your baby to enjoy kangaroo care. First, let your nurse know that you would like to hold your baby. They can make sure that holding your baby is done at the best time and that all of the right staff are present to assist with your baby's lines and leads. Next, plan ahead so that you're comfortable while you hold your baby. Go to the bathroom, eat a snack, and wear clothing that opens at the front. Some parents choose to wear a bra while holding their infant, but be mindful that this may make positioning your baby more difficult and may limit the amount of skin-to-skin -skin exposure. It is expected that you hold your baby for at least 60 minutes or for the duration of their feeding. Finally, have your phone nearby for pictures. You'll want to capture those sweet memories. Hi, I'm Alex. I'm RJ's mom. Hi, nice to meet you. I'm Caitlin. I'm the nurse taking care of RJ. Um, are you interested in holding him today? Yes, please. Okay, great. Um, just a few things before we get started. Did you wash your hands? I did. Okay, awesome. And then do you need to use the bathroom at all? No, I just used it. Okay, perfect. We try to hold for at least an hour. Okay. Um, so does that work for you? Yes. Okay, awesome. So I'm just gonna call in some help. Okay. Um, I'm Nora. Hi, Nora. I'm, the, I'm RJ's primary RT for the day. I'm gonna help you get him out to hold. Awesome. And I'm Sarah with Occupational Therapy. I'm gonna help make sure RJ's comfortable once you're seated and he's on your chest. Okay. All right, so before we get started, we're just gonna get him into a really good position and then we'll walk you through how to pick him up. Okay. All right, so we're just gonna put a little blanket yeah, underneath him. And drop that down. Oh, yep. yep, thank you. All right. All right. We got the tube. Yep, tube secure. All right. Perfect. All right, you ready to rotate him? Yep, go ahead. Thank you. Good job. All right. Okay, so mom, I'm gonna have you come on in okay. and I'm gonna have you take down your gown a little bit, which looks great. Is this a good height for you? So you'll basically be leaning over right onto your chest. Can you lower it just a little bit? Yeah, sure. How does that work for you? That's perfect. All right, perfect. So you're gonna lean on over grab behind his head and we're gonna kind of help you as you do it. Perfect, you feel comfortable? Yes. All right, so we're gonna have you slowly come on up. There you go. Looks great, you feel good? Yes, chair right. secure. I'm so good. I'm gonna have you take a step back towards a chair. Perfect, and then we're gonna have you slowly kind of lower you down. Okay. Perfect, nice. you wanna scoot back a little bit. RJ looks great. Mm -hmm. All right, awesome. How do you feel? Good. All right, so I'm just gonna take this blanket away and then we'll keep them nice and warm. Sarah's just gonna wrap around this blanket. And underneath this armpit here. And we're gonna make sure RJ's arms are tucked in close to him. So he's comfy. And then I'll have you bring that hand to the top of this blanket. Perfect. And then I'm going to tie this underneath your armpit here. And I'm going to tie it two times so it's good and secure. And get it pretty snug here. And I'm going to go one more time. And we always want to make sure RJ's head is facing this way, the same way as the circuit and the ET tube, okay? Do you mind if I secure this to you? Yes, that's fine. Um, because RJ is really little, I'm just going to put this blanket right on top and we'll just recheck his temp just to make sure he's nice and warm. Okay. And I'm going right. to secure the tubing right here okay. real quick. And are you comfortable? Yes. Okay. And we'll put up your feet too so you're nice and comfy. Okay. Thank you. Making sure all the equipment is in an appropriate position will help the transfer to go smoothly, which helps your baby stay calm throughout. Also, did you see how the standing transfer allows for fewer transitions for the baby? If you feel comfortable on your feet, we recommend the standing transfer as your baby may tolerate the transition from the bed to your chest more easily. Finally, kangaroo care is for all parents. 
While kangaroo care helps with milk production for pumping or breastfeeding parents, there are many benefits for all parents to hold their babies skin to skin, including bonding with your baby, stabilizing vital signs, and providing your baby with positive, nurturing touch. Thank you for taking time to watch this video, and we hope that the information is helpful for your family.